What's going on, everybody? It's Mickey and the Go here with another one. You already know if you're new here, go ahead, like, and subscribe if you want or don't. I don't give a fuck. Let's go ahead and jump into it. Before we do, I have a secondary channel where I review movies, TVs, games. And I do want to show you guys something a little interesting. If you go on uh, my Reddit, right, you can check out my Reddit. Every time I've been posting videos, I've been getting hella suppressed, hella suppressed, especially when I mention the Cayman Islands, I get hella suppressed. I mean, look at this comment. This comment right here actually got more upload, uh, upvotes somehow <laughs> than the actual video. I'm at zero karma somehow perfectly with this video, but you know, in this comments, I have a lot more than zero. So whatever, say what you will. It's definitely interesting. Guys, if you have any more suggestions, please let me know how I could spread this content, spread the news. They're definitely unsubscribing people. So please check your subscription. And if you look like you're unsubscribed, please go ahead and subscribe back because I've been getting that a lot. They're definitely suppressing me through the algorithm. Seems like more and more starting, uh, starting to get the info, starting to get the videos, but please share it if you can, uh, if you want. Uh, and let's just jump into it. So this uh, little tweety tweet came from Rizzo Stonks on Twitter. He said, Kenny, uh, Ken Griffin, CEO of Citadel, filed with his personal attorney, Gregory Johnson, for 1.4 million shares of Jaws Juggernaut Acquisitions Corporation as a Cayman Islands exempt company. And I've got way more. Hashtag Kenny Jail Time. Hashtag <laughs> Shitadel Hide Your Shorts. Oh, man. That's pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. So, uh, sounds like Ken is uh, trying to make uh, a run for it to the Cayman Islands as he stalls in the Moas to buy more time with his attorneys. And that's uh, coming from Ein Fachmann. <laughs> I guess he's a German guy on, on Twitter. Uh, so anyway, that's that's pretty funny name. Pretty funny name. Uh, but yeah, guys, reverse repo. One trillion and uh, 53 million. Awesome. I don't want to keep talking about it. I'm, I'm so over it. <laughs> the, uh, the NSCC 005 accelerated approval. Um, it is slated to be published tomorrow on the Federal Register. Um, and as you know, it increases the fixed amount of collateral required for the NSCC members to put up from 10 thousand to two hundred and fifty thousand this is done in order to protect themselves and non-defaulting members this may impact the budget constraints on the smaller cap hedge funds okay uh, i would say it's pretty bullish in my opinion but as you already know um these hedge funds they have a lot of shell corporations um and you know that could definitely be a factor in getting around these kind of things but we shall see what this does. Time will tell. From what I've been hearing, things are looking pretty bullish for September. They're expecting a bunch of margin calls to be happening. So you already know when you hear the word margin call, first thing that comes to your mind, I'm sure, is GME or I guess AMC. It's really what you really fancy. Uh, I'm more of a fundamentals guy myself, so I do fancy GME a little bit more. As you already know, I mentioned it many, many times. Now, let's go ahead, jump to the ticker so we could go ahead and get out of here. So GME, uh, we ended at 163. We're having a rally, rally, rally. We're in the green all the way up until about uh, 11, I want to say about 1150, uh, 11.55. Yeah, as soon as we hit 12 o'clock, hit down into the red zone. Um, and yeah, we're having a rally, rally, rally up until around $163. And boom, short attack, didn't want us ending on a red. Hmm, I wonder why. I'm sure it's not a bunch of people selling. I wonder why. Uh, obviously, we already know AMC's looking a lot more bullish. The entire day, it's been green. So, uh, that's pretty cool. Makes me happy. I got AMC, so that's looking a little bit more bullish. Uh, but in the long run, is AMC more bullish? You tell me. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Anyways, guys, I gotta go. I have the same amount of things I gotta get done. You guys have no idea. Oh, man, I wish I could be doing this full time. I'd be jumping way more into the research, into the DD, and uh, doing many more videos. But until uh, I could do that, you know, uh, we just have to settle for this. And, uh, yeah, just bear with me, guys. Things will get better and better as uh, they've already been. So, uh, Mickey Indigo, and you already know, that's a wrap.